Thank you for tuning in to another episode of WGC Fits. Today we're going to do another little quick kind of shaft review, right? We're trying this out. Okay, so um, yeah, I'm going to talk about kind of some of the Ventus stuff that I like. Ian's going to talk about some of the 1K stuff that he likes. Yes. Starter off, Captain Ball Speed. Okay, we got a 1K orange in this guy. And we've recently just did a 3 wood one and I got a 1K black. What I find in these is they're so smooth. Very smooth. I don't, I've never had a premium golf shaft before in nice anything. Nice, isn't it? Yeah, and okay. it's it's a game changer and I don't think I'm ever going back. There you go. Yeah. Now, talk about what the shaft's designed to do. Low launch, low spin. Oh yeah, low launch, low spin, stable. very stable. Mega stable. But it's stable. smooth. Mm -hmm. Smooth and stable, right? Like I can go at this thing and I'm not worried about it. Mm -hmm. Not worried about it going left. Correct. And that was one of the big things we were looking for for you was confidence, right? Yeah. Um, I mean, just doing this. Yeah. It feels so good. Mm -hmm. Or this. Now, we went with... Or this. 70X in... TX. TX in the fairway wood as well. Oh, right? no. We did 70TX in this, but we did a 75X in the fairway 75X wood. 75X in the fairway wood. For some fairway. reason, I don't like to go heavier in the fairway wood. No. No, you don't. And we, we tried 85s, mm -hmm. but they just... They went... Everywhere. All over the place, yeah. You're not you're not a heavy guy, right? But I am um, a heavy guy because this is D7, just not in fairway wood. Oddly enough, so is mine. Yeah, and I just hit your irons that are weighted at like D1000, and I hit them dead straight. So I don't know what boy's golf kind of, is anymore. Boy's kind of strong, you know. Yeah. So, um, <laughs> so talking about what we like, um, so the 1K orange for you. Again, and the one K black for the and the one K black for the fairway. Stiff profiles, very stable profiles, slightly counterbalanced in the driver. Um, both very very smooth though. Very and that's smooth. Definitely something that you're going to get with that one K kind yeah. of fiber that they use. Um, now for me, I like to play Mr. Ventus. Mr. Ventus. So I got a Ventus TR uh, red in my driver, Ping LST. Um, it is a seven X, and this one's tipped a good bit. Um, a lot of bit. A lot of bit. Yeah. So for me, I like, I, I switched from a blue um, before and I kind of toyed around with a black a little bit as well. But for me, when I switched to the Ventus stuff coming from actually the Tensei white profile, um, the Ventus stuff was again, very smooth and I felt like I could trust it a bit, right? Um, I switched to the red in the driver this year, the red TR, because it's helped me create just a little bit more launch than the blue was. Um, but, but, again, not, but the red would be too much launch. The regular red, I actually tried the regular red, and we'll get to that here in a second. Um, I tried the regular red, and it was too high end. It spun too much. Yeah. So this was kind of an experiment that ended up working out really well. You know. And the tip helped it out. And the tip helped a lot. If I didn't tip it as much as I did, which was three, three and a half inches, <laughs> something like that, um, then it wouldn't. I wouldn't be able to play it because yeah. I would feel it kind of moving too much. And to be fair, this is close, but... I trust it, it gets the ball up in the air a little bit more, and I like it, it's doing what I want, right? Yeah. Um, now in my fairway woods, I have been playing these Ventus Red, so the original Ventus Red, 8Xs in these. Um, I love these, I play these really well. My fairway woods are very, very much weapons in my golf bag. They're your favorite um, club? They are, my three wood, my five wood are my favorite clubs. and. These guys just can flight them, kind of do whatever I want, and I always kind of mockingly kind of call them like my wedges from 200, you know, 40 yards because that's kind of what they are. Um, yeah, that's what this is for me. Yeah, but from, at 340, from 330. <laughs> <laughs> so, um, you know, I can flight it high, flight it low. Um, you know, I hit a lot of three woods off the tee. I hit a lot of five woods um, into like par fives and stuff, and it's just something that works. I not that I don't like my driver. I just love my fairway wood so much, it becomes a go-to, yeah. you know? Um, and then carrying through, because I do like the Ventus stuff, I also play a Ventus in my hybrid. Now, this is the Ventus Blue Hybrid. It's a 10X, and this one is... Not tipped, wow. No, this one's tipped a little bit. Well, not as much as that Not one. as much as that one, but this one's tipped a little bit. Um, but yeah, this is this is really good. This is, this is a very big reason as to why I'm actually able to play a hybrid, because I never like playing hybrids and hybrids were something that I struggled with, and that gave it some feel, right? And that's the big thing for me is, I felt like they were all just too light, too soft, too whippy. Yeah. So I ordered one of those, and it's been in the bag ever since. I forgot to mention my hybrid is also a Tensei White AV Raw. Yes. 10, or a 105. That's the one I switched out of. And it's one of my favorites. Yeah. Uh -huh. 
No, it's it's, it's old school, old yeah. school shaft. Just a good shaft. So, um, similar profiles, right? We're both looking for some low spin. Very. The orange in his driver and it's the very black low. in the fairway with his plan. Those are both a little bit lower launching. Um, pretty low launching, actually. These are more kind of mid-launching kind of windows. And again, that's kind of the difference between me not swinging a driver at 125 miles an hour and yeah. him doing so. So, But the black would be comparable. The black is comparable, yeah. The TR might actually be more comparable to this, right? So I would actually say that the Ventus black, I mean, that's like, that's just a bit extreme. <laughs> like, if you ever need to, like, you know, jack your car up, you can do it with the Ventus yeah. black, you know? I love the shaft. That's it, stiff? It's good, but it's, I don't know if many things are going to be stiffer than a Ventus Black TR. Oh, okay. That's, that's like, that's a bit serious. Yeah. Yeah. I'm, I've never really successfully fit someone into that. Oh, we should try it. You know, I've got a lot of black. I've done tons of the other ones, yeah. but the black TRs, whew, strong like bull, you know? Um, so, anyway. Yeah, I don't know. What's the Cobra long guy? Uh, Berkshire. Yeah, the Berkshire comes with me. We'll try with them. Still might be a little soft for it, but you know. Well, gorilla, you know. All right. Thank you for tuning in to a, another quick little shaft review here. Let us let know us, if you, yeah. I was going to say, let us know if you guys like these, right? Some we're trying. Um, we got a couple more that we're going to try, and just, just let us know what you think. Have a good one. Peace, guys.